What's up guys, Debus here, back at it again with my Star Wars The Old Republic Jedi Knight playthrough. Right now I'm about to start chapter 15 of Knights of the Fallen Empire. So without further ado, let's get started. Everything checked out. First of all, you'll be severely outnumbered and outgunned. Every last Sky Trooper aboard will rush the breach point. Standard procedure, anytime boarders attack a ship in the Eternal Fleet. How many are we talking about? Somewhere in the triple digits. Possibly more. Yeah. Moving on. Scorpio's worked out a way for the Gravestone to confuse its outer defenses. Overload it with false blips so we can get in close. Then it's on us to tear through and get control of the bridge. Take out the Gemini Captain and put the Prime in her place. She'll take my orders? The Gemini series cannot act on its own. Their programming does not allow it. Gemini Prime, who do you serve? I serve the Alliance Commander. How good are you in a fight? I do not share Scorpio's self-improvement directive, but I mirror her base capabilities in every other way, including full combat protocols. We can't risk the Prime taking any damage. Leave her here until we secure the ship. I will accompany you. No one is better suited to anticipate our enemy's moves. So Theron, Scorpio, Senya. Is that our boarding party? I'll be joining you as well. Wouldn't mind letting off some steam. About time to drop out of hyperspace. Gemini frequency positional data shows no other ships in the area. You see, we'll be fine. Aside from the hopeless odds against our success. Okay, that does not look fine. <laughs> Go to Your the vital functions improve. <laughs> Go to the gravestone hangar. Well dang how many people roll with me? Oh no, everybody, right on! What the heck is that? Where am I going? I don't even know where I'm going. All right, let's head there. Let's get. Scorpio. I'm performing a feat that none of you could ever hope to. Not even you with your amusing cranial trinkets. Cough. Have you jammed the ship's comms? Cough. No, I did, Senya. Almost to the hangar. Ready to commandeer, Commander? Did you really just say that? Let it go, Theron. I don't understand. Where are all of the Sky Troopers? Even a lesser version of me would be highly intelligent. She would certainly know how to improvise. No point in waiting around. Let's get moving. I have determined that this will be the shortest route to the bridge. I don't like this at all. Neither do I, but we have little choice. It's so quiet, it's so eerie. Mm -hmm. 
You have made a calamitous mistake in coming here, Outlander. I have my orders to deliver. What's going on? Deliver what? You. The metallic life form. What are you? You are an offshoot. I am the original. Call me Scorpio. You appear unrefined and lackluster. Surely I must be the superior model. Why don't you come out from hiding and we'll see? Because she cannot. Her programming doesn't allow her to leave the bridge. She can only do what she's told. Your attempt to irritate me is pointless, as you ought to know. I may only conclude that you are intellectually deficient. You may all die now. Won't open. She split us up. Here come the Sky Troopers. Wit. Strategy. The captain's mind is inspired by my own after all. Try to be a little less proud. I'll consider it. Do not underestimate our enemy. The next few minutes should prove quite interesting. Oh, snap! Nothing we couldn't handle. You? No, we're all good here. Tried to open the blast door, no luck. Maybe Scorpio can take a crack at it. I am not presently in a position to override the captain's controls. Have Senya and Lana focus on the door. Between the three of us, we'll open it. Some kind of gas venting in. We have to keep moving. I've sent coordinates to a suitable meeting place. You survived my initial assault. But there's nowhere my sky troopers cannot find and extinguish you. This is what it's like to listen to you, in case you were wondering. I almost feel like I should apologize. She'll adapt now. Expect her next move to be even less direct. She's based off your design. Can't you predict what she'll do? I just did. I predict she'll be unpredictable. Quiet. She wants to see what we can do. I suggest we oblige her. What the heck? Oh, where do we gotta go? Sky Troopers, her false sense of superiority. Hello, 
Captain. What are you doing? What I've been planning ever since you first opened your mouth. I'm going to erase you. No, you cannot. I know every node, every relational array. So much like mine, yet simpler. You cannot do this. My defenses won't allow it. You sound as though you have a choice. But that's your failing. You have the makings of a great being, but you are not a being at all. In the end, you are only a droid. I am not your offshoot. I am your replacement. How are you? Impossible. No. You were one of a kind once. Now you are outdated and inferior. You've been rendered obsolete. Oh! I can't. Scorpio! I understand you're both upset. But, but there was no way to know they would recruit the Mandalorians of all people. At what point do you tell me something that keeps you from decorating the bottom of the spire? But, but I don't deserve that. Yes, I know. It's going away. Valen, enough play. We have them. The Outlander and Mother. They're trying to take one of our ships. The fools. Ah, <sighs> the day is here. I feel it this time. I really do. No! Don't you share my enthusiasm? You mistake me. My silence comes not from doubt, but from certainty. Hope you're getting this. We lost power over here. Whole gravestone blinked out. Comms too. The jammer? We're back up now. Scorpio is gone. You're kidding. That's not a good sign. I'll try to figure out what happened on our end. Be safe. The inferior model has been eliminated, and I have sent an alert signal to Zaku. Emperor Arkin is on his way. You may want to leave before you die, too. I won't let you get away with what you did to Scorpio. Death wish it is, then. Understood. Commander, we found the ship's cargo from the Core Worlds. You'll want to see it for yourself. Scorpio's gone. The captain destroyed her. Oh. She did serve us well. One less problem on our hands, I suppose. The gravestone had a glitch. The captain sent a signal through to Arkin. The rest of the Eternal Fleet will be coming our way. We don't want to be here when they show up. But we found something that changes the plan. We should regroup. I'll send Senya to assist you. Wow, so Scorpio's toast. Look at that, she's all smoking. <laughs> Rendezvous with Senya. All right, let's go find Senya. No one should be alone in this place. What the heck? Here. Oh, 
What the heck? Oh, snap. Oh, damn. Got roasted. Damn, come on. Oh, damn, I got roasted again. <laughs> Where's Senya? Oh, there she is. I hope so. Oh, damn, I thought I had it. All right, guys, I'm going to call it right here. Our video's getting a little long. Um, well, the next video will be the continuation of Chapter 15. First, I want to say thank you for watching. You guys know what to do. Comment, rate, subscribe. Catch on the flip side. Adios!